what's up you guys welcome back to my channel so oh my god i just want to say thank you guys so much for the love on my last video i did not expect that much of you guys to be so interested and really want me to actually make this into a series a lot of you guys even suggested that i make a gaming channel you guys <laughs> I did not think it would do that well like literally everyone is tweeting me so um, I'm definitely gonna make this a series for sure but if you guys think I should make a gaming channel let me know if I should make one because I don't know I've never I'm not I don't I don't even consider myself a gamer I guess now I do because I play sims yeah so I'm back and I'm gonna play with Aiko Mai and I'm gonna continue her life. So this is part two of Aiko's Rags to Riches and Aiko has to go to work. So let's see what happened. Um, if you haven't watched the first video of me creating Aiko and moving her into a new city and trying to make friends, then make sure you watch the part, make sure you watch the first video. This is the second video, so let's get into it. Also, you guys, I don't have on any makeup today. I didn't, I couldn't, I just couldn't put on makeup today. I cleaned my whole house and I like oiled myself up. So I'm like feeling like, you know, my natural self. Plus, this isn't a beauty videos i don't have to put on makeup so i get an excuse um but i got the heater going i got my tea and i got my blanket i gotta be warm when i play so i'm ready but where we last left off was i go got kicked out of <laughs> marcus's shower so we gonna um mm, let's see what's going on a lot of you guys were asking me like why was Aiko fiending to make friends and she wasn't fiending to make friends I was trying to fulfill her aspiration so you know her aspiration was um I think party animal so she had to make at least like three friends and introduce herself to 10 people um but I couldn't fulfill it because everybody was being so standoffish so I think I'm gonna add that into the game I think I'm gonna add the fact that Aiko is more so like you know almost looking for friends and she almost like kind of needs friends because she doesn't have her parents there to take her serious she doesn't have that family support this is something that i mentioned in the last video um you know her father takes her as a joke and stuff like that so i think i'm gonna play off of that that she really depends on those friends to be her family and have those people there that she can talk to her taking a shower in marcus's shower he was very uncomfortable about that so i think that's something that's gonna also go with her character of her trying to make friends she gets a little too comfortable too quick um people are not comfortable with that i know if somebody gets too comfortable with me i'm like what's wrong with you so let's kind of play that in Aiko. let's like kind of make her a little too she comes on very aggressive and very strong wanting to be friends so Aiko has work in five hours i don't know how to get her performance up to to um whatever this is like how do you get her performance up let's um anyway Aiko needs to clean so let's go over here and clean up because she don't need to be a nasty dirty hound okay and let's also add to our instagram story and what else we gonna do let's see what's coming up so tomorrow is lottery day okay nice she better win period and then the next day it's harvest day and then whatever else so i'm thinking on friday or saturday we plan a party um but let's see let's see what other people we meet um so as of right now are we friends with aisley we're still not friends let's see what else she has to do okay so she still needs three more friends so let's invite someone over what time is it it's 5 a.m no one's coming over so let's um practice speech practice acting let's practice her acting Aiko might just want to be an actress you never know she's like and the wind blew and i was there and guess what i saved him Oh my God, we have an autographed picture by Judith. 
whoa can we put this yeah we can let's put this um she's gonna put this somewhere in her room because she's a psycho she's gonna be like a psycho over uh judith actually let's text judith let's see if she's up is that not weird i think that's really creepy oh we don't even have judith in our text messages <laughs> dang this girl needs some friends okay okay so she has developed an acting skill and she is at one. Oh, maybe we could talk to our neighbor i feel like we need someone to talk to in this game let's um enthuse about interest oh she left us Ugh. okay anyway we're gonna visit her apartment we're just gonna knock on her door and we're gonna go ask her about, you know, the social media life. She's gonna be really nervous about her first day at this job. And, you know, she's, she's new to the city, so she doesn't really know much. So she's gonna confide in her neighbor for some, you know, moral support, emotional support. Okay, so she has work in a few minutes. So, um let's look at this apartment what her apartment look like oh she got a little studio cute girl very cute it looks better than mine um so let's put pep talk because we definitely need a pep talk right now it's like hey girl i really need your advice i don't know what to do i'm scared help She's like, I'm really nervous about this job. You know, I don't know anyone there. Like, can you give me some advice? And Penny's like, um, you'll be fine. The best thing I can say is to just be yourself and make sure you're just going to work. This is Aiko's first job, so she just literally doesn't know what to do. She has no work history, nothing. She's like, okay, well, I'll see you girls later. So Aiko's going to work. Aiko's headed to work and let's see how her first day does. Hopefully she goes there with, hopefully she gets a promotion. Alexander God, no one will ever believe you. What do we do? Ah, we didn't do nothing. Okay, Aiko is tense at work. She's not happy. Aiko's home from work. She brought home $132. Okay. Nice, but why didn't she get a promotion? Like, okay, we're gonna have to like literally go to work one more day and if she doesn't get a good review, she's quitting. Like, Aiko does not wanna do this. Um, Let's send a text to, let's send a text to Marcus and see what happens. We wanna apologize about you know the other day we made him really uncomfortable so we're gonna just apologize penny is in the hallway and we're gonna vent to her about our first day at work she's like girl guess what happened like you don't understand like i will never ever ever do this ever again like this is the worst mistake of my life i don't want to do this penny's like it's not that serious relax I was like, you don't get it. I am so annoyed. She's like, I had the worst day at work. This is the worst. I don't want to do this anymore. Like, what can I do? What can I do? Penny's like, hmm, what do you like though? Like, what do you want to do? I need to do fashion. I am into fashion. I'm a fashion girl. I can put together anything. Like, do you see me? I'm beautiful. <laughs> anyway. Um, she's gonna make a quick meal. So let's make a ham and cheese sandwich. That's not gonna fill her at all. She needs to learn how to cook. She's just gonna make a quick ham and cheese sandwich because she wants to go outside, honey. She is that outside girl. She's like thinking about herself, like, what do I really wanna be? Um, we're gonna travel to, we're gonna go to, hmm, where should we go? So Aiko needs to go to the gym. She's going to let some steam off. She's going to go to the gym and just like break some steam off because she wants to get fit anyway. So there's a gym right near her house. So she's just going to go there and relax. She don't need the drama. She don't need the stress. Like give my girl a promotion. All right. So Aiko is at the gym. So we're going to change her outfit into her jogging outfit. Where is it? 
We're going to change her outfit into her jogging outfit. This is her little jogging outfit. She's so cute, right? I know. And she is going to work herself out because she's annoyed. Anybody would be annoyed. And hopefully this really helps her mood and, you know, makes her feel a little better. But she doesn't look good at all. She doesn't look happy. She looks like she's really stressed out. She looks like she's really stressed out. And no lie, I mean, you got to think about it. Anybody would be stressed out. She is in a city on her own. <sighs> she's stressed out from her parents. She doesn't really have money like that. Her job, like, it was her first day at work and she had a horrible day. Let's see who's around that we can meet. Daryl Charm. Hmm. Oh, who's this hunky lunky? <laughs> let's act. Let's say hi. She's like, hey. He's like, can you please leave me alone? <gasps> so we're going to ask Kayla to mentor us because, oh, look at Aiko. Aiko is really on it. Like, she's not playing. Like, this is helping her really get that, you know, tense energy out. Kayla is going to help mentor us. Um, Kayla is a rising star. And she's, I don't know if she's our friend. I don't, I don't know if she's our friend, but someone said, hey, I heard you became friends with Ainsley Cooley. She's pretty cool. Hmm. Okay, so Aiko has to really go to the bathroom. So we're going to go to the bathroom. And, oh God, she's about to pee on herself. So Aiko, like I said, she gets a little bit too comfortable. So she's going to tell kayla a little bit about you know her story like girl i just met this guy and guess what i did like he's gonna tell her about what she did with marcus we're gonna be like girl guess what i went to marcus's house and i took a shower there and he literally kicked me out like can you believe that like he kicked me out girl i can't i can't believe this oh my god this girl stinks we gotta go away from her look at her she's dirty anyway Let's see who else is here. And, oh, this is the gym trainer. So let's say hi to her because we're definitely gonna need her. And we're gonna like need her help. Wait, you guys, Mar Marcus is here. Oh, what? What? Marcus is here. Oh my god. Wait. Marcus is here? Okay. We need to say hi. We need to ask him something. We're gonna say like, do you have a minute? Let's ask to hang out. We're gonna ask him if he can hang out for a second. Uh, why do I feel like this is real life? Okay, so he's feeling a little miserable. So we're gonna give him a heartfelt compliment because we're kind of embarrassed. We're gonna give him a heartfelt compliment. I feel like we need to go in our own privacy. Like, literally, she doesn't want to talk to all of these people. Okay, so they're going over there to talk. She's like, do you please have, do you have a minute to call? He's like, make it quick because I can't believe you took a shower in my place. She's like, you, I'm, I'm really, like, I'm really sorry about this. I don't want to say it in front of everyone, but I'm really sorry. And he's like, it's fine, it's cool. She really can't talk to him right now because <sighs> all these people. Oh, girl. Oh, my God, you guys. I, I go need some sleep. She's getting real tired. So we about to go home. We're gonna just go home and she's gonna get some rest. Okay, so Aiko's gonna get some sleep and she's about to pass out and we do not need that. So we're gonna get some rest and we'll see her in the morning. Okay, so Aiko is finally up and she is going to make herself something to eat. This time she's gonna make something really filling because she has work in a few hours. So she's going to make some breakfast. It's 5.30 in the morning she literally wakes up so early so she's gonna have some eggs and toast because that's all she knows how to cook and she got work at four hours so she gotta make it quick she's really angry um she's mad because there was a mouse and she's hungry and she's sore from working out 
So she's like pissed right now. Girl, she don't know how to cook at all. Like, whatsoever. She's just like me. <laughs> she's just making herself eggs and toast. She's making herself the eggs now. Um, all she needs is some bacon and she'll have a bacon, egg, and cheese. Oh my gosh, sis. You have work in three hours. Please hurry. She's, you still got the food from the other day? Oh my god. And her fun is going down. So Aiko gets bored really quick. That's why she always wants to be around people. Just like entertain herself. Like she doesn't know how to spend time with herself. Or like get to know herself. She doesn't know those things. Okay so she's finally finished eating. So she's feeling a little bit better. So now she's going to come and take a cold breast shower. And that's going to make her feel a little bit more energized. So that she has you know fun at work. So we're gonna actually like, let's see. Hmm. Let's practice our speech right now because she feels like this is gonna help her at work because maybe she doesn't know how to greet customers the right way. She's like, hey sir, how may I help you? We have a large sale today and we are having 50% off of everything. If you want anything, please let me know. My name is Aiko Mai and I'll be at your service. <laughs> And she's like, I'm dead. Okay, so Aiko is now off to work. It's 9 a.m. And she'll be back at 1 p.m. So let's see how her day at work went. Okay, so Aiko is finally back from work. And she got promoted. Yes, honey. So Aiko is promoted to sales floor clerk and has been promoted to... Oh, sales, uh, sales floor clerk. She will now make an additional $7 per hour for a grand total of $40. <laughs> she also received the following bonus. Her next shift is on Thursday at 9 a.m. Yay! She's happy. So she's very happy. She's going to start singing. She's like, yes, I did it. I did it. Yeah. We're gonna visit Penny's apartment and tell Penny that her advice really worked and she's so helpful. Like, thanks Penny. Thanks for the help. Where is Penny? Penny, where you at? Is Penny home? Penny's not home. Is Penny home? Anyway, she's not home, so we're gonna use her computer. Let's um should we purchase a lottery ticket? Uh, I don't know. I don't know if we should purchase a lottery ticket. Let's purchase one. We'll purchase a lottery ticket for $100. If she doesn't win, she's going to be pissed. Because we could have used $100. We don't have $100 to spare. We're also going to have Aiko create a social media account. Um, I don't know what this is. I don't know if it's... She's adding all her friends right now. So she has created a new social media account. So... That is going to help us keep updating our social media status, which is great. Like, where is Penny? Penny, we really wanted to, you know, say hi. But you know what? Instead, we're just going to leave an affirmative note on the door because we might not see Penny today. So we're just going to leave a note on the hallway um, little thing that we kind of like communicate through. And we're going to leave her a firmer note thanking her. Let's go to Orchard A Go Go. It's kind of like a club. We're going to go there and, you know, see what's going on there. Hopefully we see Judith. Okay, so we are at Orchard A Go Go. Is that Marcus? Marcus, you're the bouncer? <laughs> Whoa. Let's um say hi to Marcus. Wow, Marcus, you're the bouncer. Oh, my gosh. She's like, hey, I didn't know you worked here. He's like, well, I did tell you. She's like, I did not know that, but that's great. He's like, thanks, I guess. He's a little stressed out. I don't know why. But let's ask if he's single. She's like, are you single? He's like, yes, I'm single. Um, she kind of has like a little crush on Marcus. I guess it's because it's like her only male friend and she doesn't realize that her having a male friend can just be a male friend. Like it doesn't have to be anything more than that. So let's kind of like try to come on to Marcus and see. And we're going to tell him 
like we're gonna confess our attraction to him we're like you know what marcus we actually i actually kind of like you he's like what like you're making my head hurt this is too much happening like what is wrong with you so thorn bailey is here so we should probably say hi let's attempt an introduction to thorn bailey because like i said Aiko is just that kind of person. She could say hi to anybody. Let's have her travel to this karaoke bar. Oh, there's a little doggy here. Let's say a friendly introduction. It's happy hour. Yes, Aiko is about to get drunk. She's about to get drunk. And we're going to say hi to Aiko. I mean, what's her name? Miko. Aiko and Miko. They should be besties. She's like, Miko, like, you are so cool. I love your hair. Like, can we just be besties? And Miko's like, what's wrong with you? Let's gossip and find out some tea. I go, I just want two tickets to the Sam and Shuno Theater sold out show. Want to go with me? Judith just asked us to go to a show with her. Bitch. Yes. Yes. Girl, Miko. Me, Aiko's gonna go now in Sims we can't go to the show with Judith I don't know why I would love to go but we can't so we gotta wait at home for her <laughs> okay so Aiko is back home she says that play that play was phenomenal Mark Kelly had such a beautiful performance he totally deserves a semi oh let's see if our relationship with Judith has went up it definitely has went up a little bit, but not too much. We still can't text her. So we're going to go inside and we're going to take a really, um, let's take a steamy shower. Because we want to get Aiko in a flirty mood because it's time for her to find a boyfriend. Um, wait. Her electricity? just went off there's a blackout no 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 no, girl you can't take a shower in this the monsters will come she's about to complain to the landlord she's like you know what i'm a struggling student i shouldn't be having these problems since you're a tenant in good standing i'll take a look oh <sighs> finally sometimes you got to just really be a bitch around here Okay, so the landlord is here. She's taking a look, I guess, at the stuff. What is she doing? Let's complain about the problems here. She's like, I shouldn't be having these problems. I'm a single woman. I live on my own. I don't have my parents. Like, this is all the money I can afford to... I can't afford repairing. Aiko's gonna try to repair it because this lady obviously is not doing a good job. And... She's about to black on her. You know what? She's she's going to black on her cuz this is this is something you should be doing. She's like, "I shouldn't be doing this by myself. I don't have the money for this. I moved in here because it was cheap." Like, "Well, I don't know what to tell you. Like this is the rent you pay." She's like, "I get that, but that doesn't make any sense. And I don't want to hear the nonsense. Please keep it to yourself." And I'm done talking at this point. It's like, "I'm done talking. Please just leave." She said, it looks all get, all good here. Just don't call me again too soon, eh? <sighs> anyway, we're going to take a little steamy shower because we want to get Aiko in a little flirty mood. You know, we need to get her a man. Like, Aiko needs a man. She never had a man. She doesn't even know how to come on to people. She's going to throw a house party and she's going to invite a lot of her friends and, you know, try to get to know them. So let's see. Let's see how it goes. Okay, so we're going to throw a house party tomorrow at 2 p.m. right after we get off work. And it's going to be at my house. It's going to be a house party. So I think I'm going to leave this video right here. Aiko still doesn't know what to do about her job. And she's about to throw a house party. Is she going to get kicked out of her apartment? Is she going to get a new job? Is she going to find the path for her? uh let's really see about that so i'm gonna leave this here thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next rag to riches sims video if i make another one if you guys want me to make another one let me know down below 
thank you guys so much and i'll see you guys in the next one